A warm welcome, my dear students, in our health class. To formally start our discussion, first, let us identify the following. Content Standard Performance Standard And Most Essential Learning Competencies The topic for second quarter health 7 is all about nutrition. Eating healthy is an important part of a healthy lifestyle and is something that should be thought at a young age. Food selection based on adolescents' nutritional needs. Nutrients, substance in food that your body needs to grow, repair itself, and to supply you with energy. On the other hand is the calories, or the kilocalories are units of heat that measures the energy to fuel everything you do from playing, making assignments, talking to your friend, and all your activities. Nutritional needs for adolescents Iron, calcium, carbohydrates, Protein and Fiber Calcium is a mineral that is necessary for life. In addition to building bones and keeping them healthy, calcium enables our blood to clot, our muscles to contract, and our heart to beat. About 99% of the calcium is in our bodies is in our bones and feet. For teenagers, you need 1,000 mg of calcium per day. Adolescence is a crucial period for bone development. Calcium is needed to reach the largest amount of bone and tissue or what we call peak bone mass. Milk, cheese, other dairy products, Okra, spinach, broccoli, soybeans, and tofu are good source of calcium. Iron is a mineral that our bodies need for many functions. For example, iron is part of hemoglobin, a protein which carries oxygen from our lungs throughout our bodies. It helps our muscles store and use oxygen. Iron is also part of many other proteins and enzymes. For teenagers, you need 20 to 21 milligrams of iron per day. Teenagers need additional iron for the growth sprout. Girls is on the onset of menstrual cycle require the increase in iron. Liver, red meat, beans, nuts, dried fruit, shellfish, spinach, pumpkin seeds, and legumes are good source of iron. Protein is a macronutrient that is essential to building muscle mass. Macronutrients provide calories or energy. Teenagers need 63 to 71 grams of protein per day. Due to your accelerated growth and development, you need bodybuilding protein-rich food. Protein is necessary for the growth and development of your body, especially your bones and muscles. Lean chicken, lean pork, fish, lean beef, tofu, low-fat yogurt, milk, cheese, 
seeds, nuts, and eggs are good source of protein. Carbohydrates are the sugars, starches, and fibers found in foods, grains, vegetables, and meat products. Though open malign in trendy diets, carbohydrates, one of the basic food groups, are important to a healthy diet. Teenagers need 2,250 to 2,800 kilocalories of carbohydrates per day. Carbohydrates are energy-giving foods. Your body uses energy from carbohydrate to perform everyday tasks you do. All carbohydrates are converted by your body to glucose. Bread, milk, potato, corn, Vegetables, fruit, whole grain, wheat, pasta, and chocolates are good source of carbohydrates. Lastly is the fiber. It is the part of plant-based foods that the body can break down. It passes through the body undigested, keeping your digestive system clean and healthy. Easing bowel movements and flushing cholesterol and harmful carcinogens out of the body. Teenagers need 20 to 35 grams of fiber per day. Fiber prevents constipation and other intestinal problems. It helps move waste through the digestive system and reduces your risk to heart diseases. Some type of fiber help controls diabetes by reducing blood glucose level. Green leafy vegetables, fruit, whole grains, oatmeal, barley, and nuts are good source of fiber. For the activity, during this time of pandemic, we need to eat nutritious and healthy food for us to be healthy. Think of the foods you must be eating this time of pandemic and enumerate all the benefits of the said foods. Here are the references that I use in doing my presentation. Photos used here are from Canva. I hope you learned something about eating right for a healthy life. This has been your teacher in health for today, Mrs. Cynthia Soledad S. Aspe, leaving a reminder that it is important to eat good food in order to be healthy and fit because you are what you eat. Have a nice day, grade 7!